Guys, tonight we are going to raise a ton of money for Toys for Tots. Stay tuned to find out how you can help us out. What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel for a very special video highlighting a very special event. So tonight at 8 p.m. Eastern over on the WhatNot app, we are actually teaming up with them for a huge 100% charity stream. And for those of you guys who already know, we asked you guys as the viewers if you would like to help us out and send over some items, some Funko Pops, some Funko Sodas, maybe some other stuff from your collection that you didn't need anymore for tonight's stream and I gotta say Joanna and I were taken back by how many boxes we have received over the past few days so without further ado here is your charity auction collection preview haul so take a look at everything that is gonna be going up for sale tonight but also guys before we jump into the preview make sure you stay until the end of the video to find out about some special stuff that's happening over on whatnot this month all right everyone so we're gonna get started with arguably my favorite line to collect and this is of course star wars so coming on down here to the bottom right hand corner we do have the valentine's day edition of chewbacca we have Jana from the sequel trilogy Kira from the Solo movie. And then we have a really awesome multi-pack here. This is the GameStop exclusive, the Bad Batch 5-pack. They are all unmasked, and I think it's an awesome one. All right, up next, we have the Target exclusive Maz Kanata. Up here, we have the Luke Skywalker Hoth edition. This was the Amazon exclusive with the pop and pin. The Glow in the Dark Entertainment Earth exclusive Mandalorian. Here is the Amazon exclusive hooded Ahsoka, which is one of my favorite Ahsoka pops that they've ever made. We also have the pops with purpose, super cute BB-8, and this is a perfect style pop for tonight's auction. We also have the bait exclusive Boba Fett, the original Darth Vader, Lando Calrissian, the first order flame trooper, which is a great one. We also have Rey, another pops with purpose BB-8. Obi-Wan Kenobi from the Clone Wars. And then check this out. We have an Emerald City Comic Con Geonosis Padme Amidala going up tonight. We got that one in the hard stack and she'll be staying in the hard stack. And I'm curious to see who is going to be taking her down tonight. We also have the Fungo Shop exclusive Mandalorian with the Beskar staff, as well as Grogu with the blue cookies, as well as the Mandalorian and Grogu ornament. And check this out. We even have a glow-in-the-dark Boba Fett mini uh, Cos Baby, which is actually a hot toy, not a Funko item, but super cool. And I'm curious to see what the glow looks like on that bad boy later. So here is most of the Star Wars stuff going up tonight, but let's see what else we got. All right, so next one is a fan favorite here with some Marvel Pops that we got donated. So once again, starting at the bottom right-hand corner, we do have the Pop in a Box exclusive Winged Venom, which has a fantastic mold. And here we also have the original Captain America. Here is Kate Pride with Lockheed, which was a PX Previews exclusive. We also have the 7-Eleven exclusive Gray Deadpool with Chimichanga. We also have Thor from Avengers Infinity War with Stormbreaker. That one's a great one. Here we have Doctor Strange from his sequel movie, which came out this year, of course, in the Multiverse of Madness. Here we have the El Hero Invicto, the Iron Man version Luchador. Up next, we have the Black Light Special Edition stickered version of Magneto from the X-Men. Here is Icarus from the Eternals. Zombie Red Hulk from the popular Marvel Zombies line. Janet Van Dyne Unmasked from Ant-Man and the Wasp. We're going to be seeing her very soon in Quantum Mania. Then we have the Walgreens exclusive Elza Bloodstone, followed up by Gamora, the daughter of Thanos from the animated What If series. Then we have the LA Comic Con exclusive Doppelganger Spider-Man, and that one's a really great mold. Lots of arms. He's in a leaping action pose, which is very cool. Then we have Madam Hell from the Infinity Warps mashup line. Up next, we have the Glow in the Dark Entertainment Earth exclusive Zombie Wolverine. And then up here, we actually have a super cool Clown Deadpool. However, this is actually a custom glitter 
clown Deadpool. So the person who donated this did a very good job. And uh, I think this looks fantastic. And that should mean a lot coming from somebody who does not like clowns. So fantastic job. Up next, we have the GameStop exclusive Sam Wilson, Captain America. And he does have his wings back there. We also have the Target exclusive Blacklight Iron Man, which was part of the original Blacklight Marvel Wave. Then we have the Glow in the Dark Hot Topic exclusive Civil Warrior from the Contest of Champions line, a nice Captain America variant. And then we also have a Marvel Collector Core exclusive Iron Man Civil War Dorbs, and uh, which is very cute. So here is all of the Marvel Pops, but don't worry guys, we still have lots more in store. So up next now we have the Disney portion of today's donated items. And starting off down here, we have a really cool one. This is the Hot Topic exclusive Stone Demona from the Disney Gargoyle series. We also have the 2017 San Diego Comic-Con shared convention exclusive Glow in the Dark Negatron, followed up by Frozone from The Incredibles 2. We also have the Entertainment Earth exclusive All Blue Translucent Ariel. We also have the Pops with Purpose Minnie Mouse, which is another perfect pop for tonight's charity auction. Right up next, we have Antonio from Encanto. We also have one of Joanna's favorites. This is Nightshade Sally. Followed up by Kit and Doggy, which is actually one of the brand new New York Comic Con exclusives. We also have another brand new New York Comic Con exclusive with Professor Owl. Then we have the original Disney Store Blue Box Alice, followed up by the Edna Mode version of Jack Jack, which was a 2018 summer convention exclusive. We also have the brand new Entertainment Earth exclusive Annoyed Stitch. Up here we have the Funko Shop exclusive. Blacklight Mad Hatter. If you guys remember that drop, that was crazy when they dropped all of those Blacklight Alice in Wonderland pops. Up next, we have a really cool one. This is the Hot Topic exclusive original Flocked Bambi. And this is from 2016, the original wave of Bambi pops. That one's a really cool one. Up next, we have another great custom. And this is not only the GameStop exclusive Forky, but he is actually glitter. And I really like the way the glitter shines on his mouth and his arms. Really great job on that one. Of course, Forky is from Toy Story 4. Another great one we have here is the Monsters, Inc. Sully, where he's got the um, the trash can lid as well as the, the bowl on his head. And then rounding out the Disney wave, we have the Curtsying Alice from Alice in Wonderland. A lot of great Disney pops. Let's see what we have up next. So for this next wave, it's a little bit of a mixture. We have some anime pops as well as some animation and a few gaming ones. So we're going to start off with some pops here from Avatar. The Last Airbender. This is the Hot Topic exclusive, The Blue Spirit. We also have a trio of Big Apple Collectibles exclusives, Azula. Maybe somebody was trying for that chase if it had one. We also have the Amazon exclusive, Glow in the Dark, Admiral Zhao. We have the Glow in the Dark Box Lunch Earth Day exclusive, Spirit Ang. We love when they do these with the brown boxes. We also have Zuko. And then moving up here, we have a really cool one. This is Marvin the Martian from Duck Dodgers. We also have Sakura Miku, which is a Hot Topic exclusive. We also have the brand new New York Comic Con exclusive Yosemite Sam Black Knight, which is pretty cool. We have the Kakashi Anbu, which is a triple anime, or excuse me, a triple A anime exclusive from Naruto Shippuden. We also have the Glow in the Dark Entertainment Earth exclusive Deku from My Hero Academia. We have Sandy from Tokidoki, and this one has the official Virtual Funcon exclusive sticker. And then we have Aang with Momo here. Moving up to the top row here, we have the really funny Pushinosaurus. We also have the Hot Top exclusive Pink Pushinosaurus. And then check this out. We actually have the Chase Spartan Mark V with Energy Sword from Halo. And we also have Nisa... 
Ravon, Ravane from Magic the Gathering. I'm not familiar with that one. And then last but certainly not least, we have Hanzo from Overwatch. So some really great pops, specifically that Chase, Spartan, Mark V, as well as Yosemite Sam. Really love that Mar Marvin the Martian, but there's a lot of great ones in this lot. But we still have a few more waves left. So once again, for this next wave, we do have another mixture of lines here. We have some TV show pops as well as a few retro toys and some television. So starting off with some great characters from one of my favorite shows, we have Hunter Ron as well as the Go Toys and Games exclusive Andy with leg casts, both from Parks and Recreation. Up next, we have Demon Lisa from The Simpsons Treehouse of Horror. We also have USA Homer from The Simpsons, and this is actually another incredible diamond custom. I think the glitter just works perfectly on the shirt as well as the pants and shoes. So once again, very well done on that one. Up next, we have Gunther from Friends. We also have Tongue Lasher from Masters of the Universe, as well as Number 5 from the Umbrella Academy. Continuing with the TV show pops, we have the Sombrero version of Elaine from Seinfeld, as well as Eagly from the Peacemaker DC TV series. We also have Jesse Custer from Preacher. This one is a GameStop exclusive. Then we have Sergeant Slaughter, the brand new New York Comic Con exclusive from G.I. Joe, as well as Cobra Khan from Masters of the Universe, both from the Retro Toys line. Up next, we have Donatello from the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, as well as Claire Deering from Jurassic World. Up here, we have LeBron James from Space Jam A New Legacy, Prince Vlad from Dracula, Agent H from Men in Black International, Beetlejuice, of course, from Beetlejuice. The Funko Shop exclusive Baseball Fury from The Warriors. We also have Michi from Smallfoot. Sonya Blade from Mortal Kombat. And then coming up to the final few here, we have Peter Gibbons from Office Space. John Nada from They Live. And then also another beautiful glitter custom pop. This is Guan Yu Po from Kung Fu Panda, the Asia exclusive from 2016. And check out the beautiful glitter colors on this one. I love the way it just makes the gold and green sash just pop right out. These customs are freaking awesome. So once again, great job on those. And uh, we do have some more waves, guys. So hopefully you guys are enjoying this video. If you are, make sure to smash that like button. And of course, subscribe if you are new to our channel. So up next in this wave, we have some sports pops, some rocks pops, some DC, and even a few ad icons. So coming on down here, we have the two pack of the Griffin Brothers from the Seattle Seahawks. We also have the Suns Gorilla, which is one of the NBA mascots. We have Alexa Bliss from the WWE line, as well as Dude Love. Right here, we have Nelson Cruz from the Seattle Mariners, as well as Andre Vasilevsky from the Tampa Bay Lightning. Up here, moving into our DC Pops, we have the Big Apple Collectibles exclusive Brainiac, as well as Steve Trevor from the first Wonder Woman movie. Now moving into some Rocks Pops, we have Satisfaction. We also have the Funko Shop exclusive Jimi Hendrix, the Demon from the Kiss Band, the Hot Topic exclusive Alice Cooper, as well as Luke Spiller from the Struts. Now moving into some more DC Pops, we have the Target exclusive Bruce Wayne, as well as the Imperial Palace Joker. Love those red boxes. We also have the special edition sticker version of the DC Bombshells Breast Cancer Awareness Pops for Purpose. Hot Girl, another perfect pop for tonight. We also have the contest version of Wonder Woman, as well as the original Flash. We also have Roman Sionis, as well as the Hot Top exclusive Golden Armor Shield Wonder Woman from the second Wonder Woman movie. And the last DC pop we got, this is a really cool one. This is the Glow Chase version of Black Adam, which of, of course was played by Dwayne The Rock Johnson this past summer. We also have the Pride version of Hello Kitty, Bozo the Clown, as well as the 2021 Fall Convention exclusive Metal Robot Toucan. So another great lineup of pops, and we still got some more stuff, guys. You were incredibly generous, and Joanna and I are very grateful for everything that was sent over for tonight.
So here is our last wave of pops. We still have a very impressive wave of sodas to show off, but here's the last wave of pops. We have some oversize and some pop towns. So starting out over here, we actually have these really cool five-star figures and we have a whole set. So we have the Joker, Harley Quinn, as well as Batman. And these are pretty cool. They actually open up, so they have this little Velcro on and uh, they open up and each one has their own individual accessory so batman of course has the bat signal which is awesome then right here we have the 10 inch battle ready he-man as well as the walmart exclusive 10 inch optimus prime we also have the 2020 new york comic-con exclusive 10 inch beast man and then here are the rest of the five star figures we have poison ivy as well as batgirl and we actually really enjoy these figures we have a few of them in our personal collection as well up here we have skeletor with snake mountain this awesome really big pop town plus pop and then we have the he-man on battle cat pop ride and then last but not least we do have enchantress which is a rock candy which is actually a old school line of funko products that they used to make and this was a gamestop exclusive but guys stay tuned we have a really cool soda wave coming up next all right guys so all you soda collectors should be very excited for this lineup for tonight guys check it out we have Frozone, as well as Boba Fett, C-3PO, Werewolf, the Spooky Space Kook, the NYCC exclusive Phoenix, Master Chief, Vanellope, Snorky, a Blacklight Rocksteady, as well as a Blacklight Raphael. We have Mr. Owl, Mighty Mouse, Rudolph, Santa Jack, four Misfit Elephants, and those ones are all open commons. However, we also have two sealed Hawkmans. Those do have a chance at chase, as well as a sealed three liter maleficent as the dragon that comes over from our friends at the pop and duo and we also have a chase godspeed check that out glow in the dark 1000 piece godspeed chase this is a fantastic lineup we are so excited for tonight and we'll see you guys back in the chair in just a sec all right, guys, so hopefully you enjoyed seeing all of those items, every single one of which will be going up tonight, starting off at just a dollar. And if by chance you don't have any extra cash lying around and you happen to be new to Whatnot, we actually have a link in the description of this video, which will get you $15 of Whatnot credit that you can use tonight on any item during the stream. And that money, of course, will be added on to our 100% donation for Toys for Tots. Now, we are actually very excited because we are teaming up with whatnot and we are piloting a very special event that they are having this month for toys for tots so from december 15th through december 18th they're actually going to be having a big promotion for a lot of sellers. You guys can actually participate in this by using the hashtag Toy Drive Live. And if you guys wanna to donate to a charity like Toys for Tots or maybe a local children's hospital or something of that nature, further information will be coming out very soon for everybody who is currently a seller over on Whatnot. So make sure you are stay tuned to your emails because they will be sending out some very valuable information. Now, for those of you guys who come out and support us tonight, I'm gonna to let Joanna take over and let you guys know where your money is actually going to be going and how you guys can see it directly affecting some children in need that's for this of, holiday. That's a lot of pressure for me. It's so like, guys, everybody <laughs> who donates tonight, all the items will be shipped out tomorrow. Every single item, you will get it by Christmas as the deadlines are getting closer and everybody knows. There are some people who donated items that are coming a little late, so we will be um, auctioning those off on Monday as well, some of the scraggler items that are coming in to our P.O. box in the next few days. We will be shopping for all the items next week and dropping them off next week, which you should see in a video in the future. I am thinking in two weeks we will be dropping that video and you will see where all of the money goes for this charity. So every single penny um, that we donate, that you guys donate, will go to uh, Toys for Tots mm -hmm. and whatnot. We'll be waiving the fees to that donation. Yes. Um, I just want to give a huge shout out to everybody who has supported us over on Whatnot, supported our YouTube channel, and of course gone above and beyond in sending something over. Guys, it truly means a lot. 
we threw this out there. Um, we've been doing a lot of planning. This is an event that we've been looking forward to for the last two months, and we were just overwhelmed, and we really appreciate everything that was sent over. I also want to give a huge shout out and thank you to Joanna. She has actually done an incredible amount of legwork to get us to where we are today. I will 100% say that we would not be, be we would not be here and this event would not be happening without all the legwork she's been doing, working with whatnot, making sure that all the items have been coming in, getting processed, sorted, everything like that. Um, you know, coordinating with everybody, shipping stuff from all over the world. We have stuff from other countries for tonight's stream. So uh, she did an incredible job, and she is the backbone of this channel. And uh, I just wanted to give. A it's all about shout the out. kids, not about me. So it's let's about, talk about. It's the about kids. the kids, guys. <laughs> Last year we raised a thousand dollars. We're hoping to raise over fifteen hundred tonight. We hope to see you guys 8 p.m. Eastern. We're gonna be on for a long time and we're gonna have a blast. So with that being said, don't stop shooting till you score, guys. And we'll see you all tonight. <laughs>